Yo, yo, yo. What's going on, people? Y'all already know who it is. I know it's been a it, oh man, it's been a minute. But what's going on, everybody? This your girl, Chrome Girl 711, bringing y'all a new video. It's a welcome back video for me because I've been gone for about a month. I have been gone since the Destiny since Destiny came out. And I'm going to tell y'all why. For one, y'all know I work like a bitch. I know some of y'all been hitting me on Twitter like, yo, you all right? You good? I'm I'm completely fine, y'all. Um, Life just got in the way a little bit. I've been working my ass off. For one, because I was working my ass off uh, to get the money up to go to NYCC, which I was supposed to do vlogs for, but I just didn't have the time, man. But I will be throwing up interviews, impressions, stuff I saw, stuff I played, um, stuff that's going to be on the She Attack TV website. Um. We got some interviews with like the uh, Vegeta and Goku from Dragon Ball Z. Um, I got to play Project Cars. I got to play uh, Dragon Ball Z Xenoverse. I got videos of all that I'm gonna be posting up on the channel. Um, and I I've been gone for a minute. Yo, I've been gone for a minute, but something riled me up earlier that made me want to do a video. Like um, it's been a minute since I ranted, like like truly ranted. But yo. I was on Facebook. Y'all know I stay on Facebook on the gaming groups, talking to the people, talking to people about games and stuff like that. And I understand, like, everything is not fucking, like, perfect. Nothing is never perfect. There's always something wrong with a game. But, or a feature or whatever. It's not going to always, like, every gamer is not going to enjoy everything about a certain feature. But, yo, like, like, so serious, like, there is like a thread on my on, on this group called Gaming Battlegrounds. It's a group that I was first a part of when it first started. I've been a part of it ever since. Some of my niggas that I've been fucking with for day one over there, you know what I'm saying? Check out Gaming Battlegrounds, by the way. But motherfuckers were talking about the share play feature. I'm like, yo, share play feature is dope because I've, I've never witnessed anything like that. People say it's on PC. I mean, I wouldn't know because I don't own a gaming PC um, for Steam. But, like, the game share thing, I think it's pretty dope. Motherfuckers are complaining that it's 720p, 30 frames. And then motherfuckers are complaining because you ain't gaining no trophies off of playing somebody else's shit on your account. Come on, man. Like, really? Really? Have we, like, come on, son. Like, shit. Whoa, whoa, greatness still awaits. Come on, man. Like, Something so dope and so different that none of us have ever, like, if you don't have Steam and you never, like, never seen that shit done before on consoles, you should be like, yo, this sounds dope, yo. Like, I wouldn't care what resolution it was in because I've never got to do, like, I never thought in a million years consoles would be able to do stuff like that. But motherfuckers are complaining, bitching, moaning. Well, like, why would you think that you deserve to get... Uh, a trophy for a game that would not even make motherfuckers want to go buy the damn game. Like share play is cool because you don't have to have the game to actually play the game with your friend. You can play it for like an hour, and then if you want to go buy, it, you can buy it. But you can't get like trophies and shit off of it. That's cool because I may not like the game and I might not want that shit on my account. You know what I'm saying? Or maybe some people who like trophy like or trophy whores. You know what I'm saying? They feel like they can't trust trophies now because you letting other people play your shit. I mean, you ain't gaining the trophies. You get what I'm saying? So I feel like it's a good thing. You know what I'm saying? But like gamers are never satisfied. Ever. I feel like gamers always bitch moan and complain about something. Like it's the difference between you like not liking something and you just complaining just to fucking complain like at no no gamer is fucking satisfied i feel like gamers today will never be satisfied with anything that nobody ever does unless it's a nine or a ten and you can't deny it like uh people are shitting on sunset overdrive sunset overdrive looks like it's gonna be a great game i'm not a huge fan of insomniac even before they even went to microsoft only like the resistance series and one ratchet and clank game they're not my cup of tea like that but i will give props what props is due sunset overdrive looks fucking dope it looks amazing it kind of got that ratchet and clank feel which i'm kind of iffy about but it looks fun and to me a fun factor is all that matters when it comes to gaming and i, I think we've lost that yo i think we complain too damn much i think gamers today that 
we sometimes for some reason I feel like the internet wrecked everything and we know too damn much and now we don't get the enjoyment anymore because we know too fucking much. Like right now I know too much about certain games and I feel like it hurts my enjoyment of the game because I'm looking it's like I'm looking for something bad. Like I shouldn't be looking for something bad. I should be enjoying the moment. I, I mean I think the internet did that to me because before I got on inter the YouTube and internet and all that shit and I found out about all frame rates and HD and all this other shit. I just enjoyed the game just because I enjoyed the game. Not how it looked, how it played. It was just because it was just fun. And I feel like a lot of gamers have lost that edge of like the fun factor. You, you, you complain too goddamn much, man. Like, like, I complain, but I'm not like so down on it. Why down every game because it's not 1080p 60 frames or because the Xbox One is doing 900p or something like that because Rise looks amazing. I'm not like, come on, man. Some of these, some gamers just don't know what the fuck they want, and gamers just are not easily satisfied. Like y'all motherfuckers are the worst. My thing is, if you want all this good graphics and all this other bullshit, get a PC. I'm just saying, get a PC. Like you will have no worries when when it comes to multiplats, and then when you own a console, you can just get the the fucking exclusives. I just don't get it. The whole game sharing shit just blew my goddamn mind. Like, you really thought you was going to get 1080p 60 frames sharing with somebody over Wi-Fi. Like, really? Over somebody else's internet connection. Come on, nigga. Like, be real with yourself. But that's that's all I wanted to say. I just had to do a little rant. It just didn't make no sense to me. But, um, also I wanted to talk about the new, uh, the new patch coming. I think it's probably coming today, tomorrow for Sony for, uh, the firmware update for 2.0. That is going to be a game changer for me because it brings the YouTube app. Finally, we can upload stuff to YouTube. So I won't have to put a USB in the game, take the stuff off. I won't have to do all that because that's really what's been bothering me because I'm I'm sorry, y'all. I'm lazy. I ain't going to front. I'm a little lazy. My job kills me. I'll be tired. I don't be feeling like doing it. But if I'm on the game playing, I can go on Share Factory. You know what I'm saying? Do my little stuff to it. Ticket a little bit, put some commentary over it, and I can throw it up on YouTube right there, right then and there. Like, I can do it as soon as I get home from work. I can put up videos, and it'll be a lot quicker, a lot faster, and it'll be a, you know what I'm saying? It'll be a lot better for me. You know what I'm saying? This is really the only thing. Share play is cool, but really, this is what I want. I want to do YouTube app thing because that's really, that's really going to help me out, and it's going to help me bring commentaries and gaming videos to y'all a lot faster and a lot easier so be looking out for my channel to start popping up with a bunch of videos a bunch of topics a bunch of just everything because i'm finally being going to be able to do it because i can just do it when i get off work you know what i'm saying i stay up anyway i don't go to sleep till about six o'clock in the morning so while i'm up i can be eating cutting up video sharing it and putting it on youtube baby so Make sure y'all look out for a bunch of stuff from me, man. I'm coming. I'm back. This is your girl, Crunk Girl 7-Eleven. Tell me what y'all think about some of the stuff that I talked about. The PlayStation firmware update. Gamers just not being pleased, pleased anymore. And motherfuckers just complaining about shit that don't even need to be complained about. And actual the internet and my enjoyment of games, y'all. Like, I'm truly enjoying 2K15. I'm truly enjoying certain games. But see, it's like I know too much and I'm like, I'm looking for shit that's bad about it for some odd reason. And I think the internet just completely is doing it to me. I need to stop looking at stuff, but I can't because I'm a journalist. I have to look at this shit. But um, anyways, I'm going to holler at y'all, man. This your girl, Crunk Girl. I'm out. Holla.